Hello guys, in today's video we're gonna get into all window shortcut keys one by one. So without wasting any time, let's get straight into it. As for the first shortcut, we have Ctrl and F. Just imagine trying to find a specific word in a crowd web page. With this way, you can open search prompt and type your preferred word to find it easy as a pie. For instance, in this case scenario, I searched YouTube word and I found it easily. For the next shortcut, imagine you're surfing a web and trying to get to the top or bottom of the page instantly. You can use home or the end button to easily get the job done. As for the third shortcut, you can use Alt and Enter to open properties for the selected item easily without using your mouse. With these shortcuts, you are more relying on keyboard compared to mouse, and by using the Ctrl, Shift and N, you can create a new folder way faster. Moving to the next shortcut, Ctrl and P. With this shortcut, you can open projectors to change your output screen. Let me show you a miracle. Windows considers your app and taskbar is numbers. And by pressing Windows key and numbers, you can easily open all your apps and taskbar. Moving to the next shortcut, Windows key and arrows. You can minimize and maximize and even bringing the application to these sides. Ever thought how you can capture a particular application in your Windows? With Windows, Shift and S, you can easily do that. Honestly, this is one of my personal favorites. With combination of Windows and semicolon, you can easily open up emojis. With Windows and V, you can actually open a history out of all the text that you've been copied in your clipboard, which could be so much helping. The famous Windows and printer screen. You can take a screenshot with it and save it in your hard drive. Although many of you guys might already know this, but with Alt and Tab, you can switch between applications. You can easily rename a selected item, by pressing F2 itself. Ever wondered how to delete a file with completely skipping the recycle bin? With delete and shift you can do that. Moving to the infamous Alt and F4, you can eliminate all the applications with it. You can use Windows and Plus to zoom it in into your desktop and Windows and negative to zoom it all out. And it could have so much usage in many cases. File Explorer is like the heart of the Windows, and with using Windows and E, you can open the File Explorer without using your mouse. Have you ever lagged out on a specific application and you don't know what you should do? With Control, Shift and Escape, you can open Task Manager to eliminate the specific application that you want. Thank you so much for watching this video, and you can tap the icon up in here for more videos about how to speed up your PC. Thank you.